Thought I'd just jump in here and give you a quick tip that can save you a lot of frustration when it comes to uh, buying a laser engraver or cutter. Uh, in this case, it's an enclosed CO2 laser cutter, 100 watt. Just make sure you get the pass-through option, which has this little door in the front. It also has the same thing at the back, where you actually have the option to put a longer piece in through it that is longer than your width of the bed, so that you have that extra flexibility. Now, there are still limitations. Of course, you're still limited to the size of pieces that you can put through there because of the width of the bed. Also, the thickness of the material that you're putting in there as well because of this, this door. There are other options out there for pass-through that give you even more flexibility. But this was an option for this type of laser that didn't cost any extra. Just make sure that you do uh, choose one that has that because it just saves you a lot of headaches and makes your job easier because otherwise I'd have to figure out another way of getting something engraved on a long piece of wood like this. Just thought I'd throw that out there. Hope you like this video. Hit the like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Hope to see you here again at Dusty Workbench. Take care.